Also, this video is sponsored by OneFootball. It's a fantastic football app where you can get all your latest news from the fantastic world of football. There's not a better way to get ahead of your rivals. The link to download is at the top of the description. Please go check it out. Z99 out the third park tunnel. Hey guys, Gogsy here and welcome to episode 168 of Around the Grounds. Today it's Kilmarnock away. We've lost three games on the bounce. We've picked up four points in six games. Not really the form we want to be hitting right now. Today I'm wearing the jeans I wore last time we went to Kilmarnock. I was this unenthusiastic last time I went to Kilmarnock. Yeah, I'm going to say to no Kilmarnock as well. So today I'm only going for the pies. Keeping that negative spirit, because last time I did that, we won. Anyway, we've got a train to catch. I've got about 14 minutes to catch it. I'm on the well, and I'm on the killy pies. I'm sorry, but how on earth am I supposed to survive walking on this without slipping? Brilliant. Right now it's Christmas. Yes, it's Christmas. A few moments later. Right, so now we're in the place of Kilmarnock. Got about 20 minutes till kick off. So I've got a boot. It's acceptable here. Last time I predicted us to get beat by Kelly, we won, so here's hoping. That's it, Kiffy's getting his first goal. Yeah, come on. As long as Dunn doesn't knock it in. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. That's, that's, that's kind of what I was. Uh,
Så kan man rejse det, hvis det er sådan noget, du får. Here we are. Now it's time to go home. Uh, it's nine o'clock. We've got literally like 15 minutes, so I've got to bounce to the train station. But uh, I've had a strange night. Must admit, uh, if you were in the Jack Daniels there, if you know, you know. But uh, aye, that was certainly one to tell my grandchildren if I ever have any. But aye, uh, time to go to the train station right now. That is some strange moment. You can quote me on this in about 10 years. You'll never find a dull moment at the Jack Daniels. Trust me. <laughs> anyway, it's time to go home. Get me home now. It's the worst thing about coming through to Mother every other week. <laughs> I've got three hours till I'm back. A few moments later. Now, believe it or not, I'm actually in Glenrothes. Uh, big Jimmy the bartender. He invited me out, so I was like, aye, why no? Got to build up my gallows, I mean, getting beat by Kilmarnock, it's just unacceptable, isn't it? The next day... Considering we had basically half a team out, I thought we played really well. I mean, we had to adapt to a narrow formation, therefore we were hurt on the wings. We missed so many chances, I mean, the one with Tara, either side of the keeper, it's a goal, same with Fisher in the second half, and those were just two examples of how many chances did we have that we missed. I mean, on another day, we could have easily won that. Although, are definitely candidates for the nearly team of 2017. I mean, that's now five games on the bounce that we failed to win. It's great. Dundee at home next Saturday. I'll be looking forward to having some more Red Revolutions again. Shout out to Frisquandro, if you know, you know. We're we'll looking forward to it indeed. Honestly, the game wasn't really worth much of a post-match analysis. Because it was just a meh. You know. And the less I talk about football these days, the better. Until we actually win. And if we didn't beat Dundee, Christmas is cancelled. Anyway guys, I'll see you later. Take care. Top to toe and tail backs. Oh, I got red lights all around.